<laughs> Do not go. So apparently, in order to get this memory, we had to um, we have to buy it. The, the the three energy cans that the guy wanted. So we have to go find these vending machines now. <clears throat> there it is. It's directly directly below the rooftop. What they okay? And we just gotta make sure we stay away. From the um, there. You're new. This guy's better not drop a pink bucket in the house or something. Oh! The poncho is gone. I guess I failed in that. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I didn't even notice this. That's two. This time I'm going to collect them all. Yeah, that's the eighth one. So we're going to be getting another chance at this. All right. We just can't go to the bar. And they are way near where I'm That's the bar. I have to find the rip. Humans. Oh. Thank <laughs> you. 
Looking for someone to oh. oh, there we go. And there should be a vending machine here. Oh, there it is. Okay. Um. This is not right. Or did I already get this one and not realize it? Oh boy, now I don't know what I've gotten and what I haven't gotten. <clears throat> Yeah, I found that, but they didn't give me one. Unless, I, unless it's because I have that one already. <clears throat> it's the only explanation I can think of. Yeah, that's the only explanation I can think of. Kind of sucks because I do need all four. This is an early model of a companion. Back then, they didn't have any personality. They were just glorified auto, auto autonomous cleaners. I think it's nice that they eventually mimic humans. It's like they, mi it's like they missed them, and in a way, they kind of kept them <clears throat> from going extinct. They're good robots. There we go. That's better. Yeah. Oh boy, here we go again. Uh,
Oh, I can pick it up. I wonder if it's... Nope, that's not the reason. Well, to be honest, there is supposed to be another one. <clears throat> yeah, I found one above and the um up, yeah, up here. I wonder if I can find it again. You guys made a mess. Oh well. Hi. Don't mind me. I don't do anything. This one there was a vending machine up there. It's the one that it's telling me it's not working. That's the one. That's our fourth one. <clears throat> I knew I wasn't crazy. I mean, I am. No, no, no. Go back up. Go back up. Because we gotta go back. I'm gonna collect the eight sheets. So I can get that out of the way. Yeah, I want Hello, all the way. Comes inside, goes to the bar, and puts it. The bar doors.
Um, <clears throat> oh, I didn't even notice that. <clears throat> That's probably the one I was missing. All right. Yeah, we're gonna, gonna do all the side stuff before we continue. <clears throat> Try to 100% the game and when go, really. So. Mm, I left to it. I know I've gotten this. <clears throat> oh, there it is. Okay. There we go. Tell me nothing. <clears throat> okay. Oh boy, here we go. I gotta go to Yuliot's place. You can wait a Right? <clears> hmm. <throat> I know. Feel so bad. Here we go. Thank you. Oh, 
Oh. Oh, I guess I'm too sucky. <laughs> Not yet. <clears throat> oh, um, right. I wonder what I'm supposed to do. Oh, I have to go into the bar. I wonder if I can go in without <clears throat> even speaking to him. Hey, little fuck. <clears throat> Come here. I managed to get that signal. Oh. Hold up, man. Okay, I got kind of important business to deal with. <clears throat> Alright, we're still we're still safe. We can still do things. There it is. Alright. <clears throat> Ah. Six. Found it. Found it times. Hmm. So there was one in here. Oh, we're so close to it. Okay. One more. Oh, I was stuck somebody. Ah, oh, okay. Oh man, I have to remember where um that was. There. What? So the piano. And that's all it. Me down. Oh, this is gonna be a little bit, a bit annoying, because I have to give him all the cheats and he has to play all of them. I mean, it won't be annoying for me. I like to hear the music. It's just. <clears throat> Hey. Well, it's your lucky day because T Bus sounds cool. Watch that.
Yeah, I have to hear. He's got to play them all so that we can actually give them them. He has to play them to the bridge, right? Fate attack the program. The way you can do that. Halfway there, folks.
Almost. The last one. Hey, that's the last music sheet. You've done very well, little one. Have this badge. It's a token of my gratitude. Let's see what this is. What is this last piece? Unreadable. Not very readable, but I could still try. Kind of glad we did this because that was a requirement. So apparently we need this badge because it gives us the achievement. Anyway, I know where to take the um poncho now. I had, apparently it was <laughs> while looking up the music sheet. Info, I was I stumbled upon where it I'm looking for any sheet music to play the guitar to add some ambiance. If you find any, bring it bring them back to me. I live near the elevator. I get the poncho? No. There you go. Thank you. This is so much fun. It's I'll be honest, it's been a long time since I played an actual game and just enjoyed playing it. Most of the time I'm just trying to get it done because it's like so many games I started and then not. And it's just like, oh, I have to finish this game even though I started something else. But for this, I kind of want to go all the way. Which. I'm going to attempt to do by the end of it. So, for now I'm 100% it. I bought all the items. Oh yeah, I have to find... <clears throat> I gotta find the uh, alien. alien. This No. Oh, oh, okay. It's this one. Oh, whoops. Whoops, I wasn't paying attention. Hey. Hey. That's gonna happen. Oh, where did you find this? It's amazing. Let me try it on. Thanks for the poncho. Please come see me if you ever need anything fixed. Sure. You're very nice. That's a rare trait these days. If you ever want to hang out, you're always welcome. 
Let's see you around. Uh -oh. Apparently, it's a requirement to actually do that for the story. So, mm -hmm. I gotta go. Now, now we can go to the bar. So is that purpose? Oh. <laughs> Let's see if I can get this thing working. Oh my god, look at that monitor. So old school. Mm -hmm. I almost got it. Hello? Can anyone hear me? Hello, yes, we can hear you. We are from the slums. We're looking for a way out and... Wait, is that you, Zeltabar? Zelt... Zabel... Beltazar? Momo? I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice, Zeltabar. Where are you? <clears throat> are the others okay? We are safe. We found a way up. Hmm. Hello? Do you still hear me? You have to go through the sewers to reach us. Very dangerous. Zerks everywhere. Look at that code. Sewers. How? Hello? Damn it. We lost the signal. I can't believe it. Zeltazar is alive. He and the other outsiders managed to go up through the sewers. The sewers are the most dangerous place in the slums. But if, if Zeltabar made it, there must be a way. <clears throat> Uh-oh. You'll never get past sewers. It's a best with Zorks. They'll make a quick meal out of you, especially you, little one. Many tried their luck in the past. It doesn't end well. Anyway, I warned you. Your business is none of my business. But why say anything at all? Sewers. <laughs> Sewers. His father, Doc, used to be a great scientist. He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago, he went off to test the device and never came back. Service has never been the same since. <clears throat> <clears throat> Don't listen to Samus. He's just scared like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the Outsiders. In his notebook, Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. That must be where he was working on it. There must be there might be a clue in Sierra Miss's apartment. Come on, follow me. Where are we going? Mm -hmm. Are we gonna run? Or are you gonna run? Yes, we're walking. I'm walking here, guys. So angry at me. Don't blame him though. I did drop a um I did cause one of them them to drop a paint bottle. Paint can on them. Come on, Sam, let's open the door. <clears throat> you know your father would have wanted would have wanted uh, to help us. Well, that, is, that was to be expected. This, this situation is pretty tough on Sarah's. He doesn't want to hear about the outsiders anymore. He won't help me, but you. I think I have an idea. Yup. <clears throat> Here, take Doc's notebook and show it to Sarah. Okay. It contains a lot of information that will hopefully act as an 
An electroshock. Find the secret lab, little outsider. I'm going back to the bar to try and reestablish communication with the others. It's not over here. <clears throat> what are you doing here? I told you, getting through the sewers is a suicide mission. Leave me be. Here. What's this? Wait, is this my boss? Oh wow, I never knew. There's a secret room here in our flat? Where? Let's find them. Let's get that lore. What's this? Just knock it all down. Wanna find a secret? Tear it all apart. Oh! 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 Alright. Oh. I never noticed that digi code before. How did I miss? I have no idea what the password code for the password is. Why is there four clocks? Hmm. Two, five, one, five, five, one. Aha! <laughs> I can't believe that actually worked. I can't believe that really worked. That the clocks were oh, the clocks were the key. Is there a hint that tells you, or did I just get lucky with that? Wait for me. I want to see the secrets. I've never seen this room. I can't believe you managed to hide it from me all this time. These blueprints, they must be for his Zerk weapon. Papa was always so secretive with his work. He told me the weapon was working in theory, but it needed a real life test. He went outside the slums and he never came back. Well, can you rebuild it? Can you build a new one? Okay, so. Robot head news headline Zerks are officially no longer under control. They now eat metal. Oh. In other words, they evolved, it sounds like. Concept. Life-based handgun. Low priority. Visual appearance size. Decimal ammo. A high priority. Test in real condition. Objective. 20 zerks destroyed per second. Ooh. That would be efficient. Kind of. You're going to have to up that number a little bit. Probably to 100. It's perfectly 1,000. Oh, oh, oh. Where'd he go? Broken tracker. Finding anything interesting? Wait, I remember that. That's his tracker. Papa always used that tracker to keep an eye on where I was. Maybe we could reverse it to find where he was. I can't believe my Papa might still be alive. I missed, I've missed him so much. You need a weapon for the Zerks, right? My Papa definitely took one with him. We just need to repair the tracker so we can find it. Someone in the slum should be able to help. Come with me. I'll open the door for you. Oh. Okay. That's a horrible feeling. I need a pain pill, I think, because my back and chest are in this. Oh, no. You gotta fix that tracker. You're a resource, sir. Maybe you can find someone in the sub to help. Oh, I know someone.
Oops. I didn't have to hit that twice. Watching some TV? What are you watching? It looks like a volcano. Or a mountain. Need your help. Oh, nice potato pizza. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, that's great traffic. I recognize this bottle. It's a tall Tomia BR twenty two thousand. You can track anyone with this little gadget, man. Let me take a look. Just gotta give it an update and. One more thing. Villa. Villa. Big stretcher. There you go, little one. Good luck on finding who you are looking for. Genius of the slums. Where'd it go? Oh. You did it. You fixed it. Well done. Give it here. Hmm. We got a ping. Is Papa really alive? I can't believe it. Let's follow the tracker. Maybe we'll find what Papa wants. And we're going to close the door to your place. This must be it. He really left. He really left the slums. It's dangerous out there, but I must be sure. I need to know. Let's do this. Let's be careful. Go. That moment when the cat has more courage than you. <laughs> Let's see. 
What's going on? Memory or anything? Nope. Look at all these Zerg eggs. They will eat us. I can't do this. I'm not as fast as you. The Zergs will get me for sure. Here, take this badge. My papa will recognize it. He will know that you're a friend. I'll open the door for you. Look at how huge this wall is. I remember, it was a symbol of the division between those in the slums and the midtown. That and the fact that they kept throwing their garbage down here. What a horrible thing to do. Maybe that's why they failed. Pretty much. that in. Alright, I'm gonna... I'm gonna take a quick break here. And then we'll continue.